welcome to Kitchen Basics 101, where I teach you the bare bone basics as if you have never cooked a day in your life from the perspective of a mom. mom. Had a lot of requests for like meal prep, um, which I think is an interesting idea because essentially meal prep is just like making dinner and then packing it up into individual portions to eat throughout the week, like warm up in the microwave or something or on the stove top. I just made a video with doing roasted broccoli and we just did a video doing roasted potatoes. And now I'm going to make a protein that's so easy to go with this. I'm gonna do a chicken sausage. These are the chicken sausages. You can get them in any grocery store. But you can use any type of sausage that you like. If you look at the bottom here, this says fully cooked. And you can just tell by looking at it that this looks more like a hot dog than like raw meat. This is a fully cooked sausage. There are tons of sausages in your grocery store that are fully cooked, which is great. That makes it for easy, easy, easy use for a new chef. You don't have to worry, did I cook it enough? Am I gonna die? You're gonna be fine. These are fully cooked, smoked, likely. Could be kielbasa, could be little smokies, could be chicken sausage, could be any type of cooked sausage. Just look on the package to make sure it says fully cooked so we don't poison ourselves. This is from Costco. It comes with three of these sleeves, but I think at the grocery store you get one like this with like five sausages. So we're just gonna make one pack. I'm just gonna give the back a little slice with my knife. I think you can also like pull it apart. Let's see. Oh, psych, it does peel open. Here you go. Peel it open. Pull your sausages out. Boom, boom, boom. In theory, you could eat them just like this because they're cooked, but I'm sure they don't taste very good like this. So what I do is I coin them up into thin little coins, okay, like this. I try to cut in a way that you can see me cutting. I'm doing two sausages at a time. Oh, did you see that? One just ran away. Hold on, let me go get her. So when we were talking about the meal prep, here's my thought, right? We prep the sausage, you put a, a scoop of sausage, a scoop of the roasted potatoes, a scoop of the roasted broccoli, boom, meal prep, right? They would hold beautifully, warm up from cold and probably like maybe one minute in the microwave and your food would be ready to go. So I think that's a great easy food prep situation. Most of the uh, kids here don't eat leftovers, so I don't do a lot of food prepping. Plus I have to cook so I can make content for you. So we don't do a lot of food prep here, but I think that would work, right? Scoop of roasted broccoli, scoop of roasted potatoes, and then this sausage, which I'm gonna show you how to make. So I'm just coining it up and I'm putting it in my big 12 inch frying pan. Another one tried to run out of here. These are on the roll. When I did my raw sausage video, I have like a breakfast sausage video in the playlist. Everyone was like, oh, I always add water. I don't do that when I'm doing raw sausage, but I do do that when I'm using a cooked sausage like this. Because the sausage is always co already cooked, it could dry out really easily. And we want it to get warmed all the way through and then crispy. So I'm just gonna put about a quarter cup to a half a cup, uh, maybe half a cup of water in this pan. We've got it on the stove top. In a 12 inch skillet, I'm gonna put um, half a cup, just enough to cover the bottom of this pan of water. I've got this on medium high heat and we're just going to let them get all warm in the pool here. Don't worry, I know it's all bubbly and boily looking, but all this water is gonna cook off and then we're gonna brown them up, okay? Whole process takes mm, a little less than 20 minutes. Okay, I just wanna show you, it's been a couple minutes. You can see that water is already starting to disappear, see? You just have to trust the process. It starts to evaporate. This is the part where we're gonna start browning the sausage up. Like I told you, these are completely cooked. So now it's just a matter of how brown and crispy do you want them. You can cook them to this point. I'm not going to. I'm gonna get them really crispy, crunchy, and blackened. I'll show you where I like them. But it doesn't matter. You can cook them to as brown as you like. Voila, done so easy. I'm gonna show it plated up with some roasted broccoli and some roasted potatoes as soon as they're done. So there we go, roasted potatoes, roasted broccoli, sausages. It's like a perfect little meal prep, throw that in a container, you're good to go. Or like me, eat it for dinner.